Hello everyone and welcome back to Starfield. We're now on episode 2, so let's get going. Come on, uh, Bosco. Okay, hang on. Before we do that, I need to... Uh, get a gun out. God, look at the scenery. Absolutely stunning. Just going to follow this brick uh, reddish path. Oh, hang on, it splits. Be careful, Captain. Alien. Okay, scan creatures, minerals, and plants. Each unique item scans progressively. Your survey data, planet complete survey data can be sold for credits. Ooh. Creatures are often unpredictable. Holster? No. Okay. Ooh. 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 Creek Research Lab. Out. There's a lamp here. What's that? That's a sand garden. Curious. These are United Colonies markings, but we are in Free Star Collective space. It then stands to reason that this yeah. was once a secret UC facility. Okay. I will admit the graphics are really, really good. Um. Sorry, I've got, uh, my eyes are watering for some reason. Is there anything here that I can grab? Okay. Coffee mug. Okay. Check. Oh, impact drive. I could use that. Uh, Bosco, what are you doing? Do you have to make so much noise? I know you're a robot and everything, but... Hi. Hi. Hey. Don't you fucking try and stab me, boy. Yeah, you get a boss, though. Hi. Ow. Ow. You shoot me. Ooh. Okay. Uh, Bosco, get out of my... Bosco, get out of my way. Okay. Let me go to inventory for a minute. Uh, new items. Uh, I want to 
No, I don't want to drop that. Don't want to do that. I do want to drop that. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. Mm, I don't want that. I might want that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Mm, I'm going to use that one. No, that one. Delete. Delete. Uh, I don't need you. What's that? That is a laser pistol. I'm going to use that. Okay, let's see how that fires. Okay. Um, so I might change it to that. Just hopefully kill some people. Not interesting to know. Okay, is there anything in here that I can use? No. Nope. Nope. Come on, Bosco. Classic United Colonies. Put something in a cage until it kills you. Nope, nothing in there. One more time. One more time. And night night. I'm going for help. You're going for help? Credits. Yes, I'll take you. Is there anything in there? No. Okay. What? Let's go. Get out. Oh my God. Get out of my way. Credits. What? Okay. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Hi. Uh, oh, explosive maelstrom, I'll take you. And I'll go that one, thank you. Ooh, nice. No, I'm not going that way. Hang on. Wait, wait, hang on. We've got someone trying to jump our score. Hold them off here while Brogan sets up on the roof. There, I can know. I know you're up there. Hang on, let's see what you've got. Uh, nothing. Okay. Is there anyone else down here? Yeah. 
nothing. Oh, there's a notebook. I don't want that. I'm detecting a safe nearby. We could make use of whatever is inside, provided you had some digi picks and a disregard for personal property rights. Pick there. Okay, let's have a look at scene. Fill all the open slots in every layer to open the lock. Select a key and rotate it until it all it lines up with the gaps in the security layer. Slot the key to fill the gaps. Each key can be only used once. Okay. into that but I'm gonna go up here and go that way As a new captain? You working with Barrett or did you pry the ship keys out of his cold dead hands? Uh I'm with Constellation. That's right, I killed Barrett. So tell me tell your parrot runs to back off. Oh no, you see, we weren't really after Barrett. We're after that ship. Every Crimson Fleet rook hears about the frontier. That constellation keeps treasure hidden in the cargo bays. The loot from a hundred planets. That statement is partially correct. The frontier has been to many planets and moons. But the only things held in the cargo bays are spare parts, dust, desiccated food particles, and a variety of species of ant. I don't care what kind of lies Barrett programmed that... Uh Open fire! I got you. Protocol dictates that I am to return to the launch. Hi. Okay, why am I jumping so high? Okay, we need a room. Okay. Okay, uh, nothing on you. What about over you? All oh, credits, thank you. I need those credits more than you. Um, okay, so how am I going to... Okay, I need to somehow get... Ah, eh, ow! Okay. Yes. I don't want to fight pirates. Captain Adam. Thank you. To reach the launch, we must jump to the planet Jemison in the Alpha Centauri system and then right. land in the city of New Atlantis. Do not worry, this will all become second nature before too long. Tab. Uh, what do I want? Tab. Tab. Ah. 
Oh, okay. Hang on. This way. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on the You will be scanned as you enter the city. Okay. Oh, Roscoe's coming, that's good. The masters just it provides free transportation throughout the city. We can take it directly to the water is quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. Uh, which way? We need to go that way. Okay. Let me just go back to my inventory. I want to take you off. Well's been having brownouts all the time. Mast finally sent someone down there, but nothing's changed. Here we are, the lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. Hi, Roscoe. Captain Adam. Yes. Everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now. We appear to have a visitor. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Uh... I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. 
there. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Okay. What happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, <coughs> if you expect us to believe in fairy tales. If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. That's it. Just like the others. And to imagine, we thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god, that's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the subtle systems can do that. None of them. This proves that... Easy, girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Godfrey? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend here? <laughs> So, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Okay. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. Okay. And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. Alright, thank you very much. Alright, now go into inventory. Space under you. Cool. Alright, let's go have a look around. This must be a garden of some sort. Mm. There's a sandwich. Sandwich. Mm, yum. Sorry, I took your sandwich. Ow! That was a door. Alright, let's have a look around, Bosco. Pen, I'm taking that. Uh, Marina's compass. Ooh, nice. But, but uh, uh, compass, scissors. I don't want scissors. Okay. I've occasionally had my doubts about constellation as an investment, but now, well. It's clearly money well spent. Okay, thank you, whoever you are, old man. I'm I am at your service, Captain. Well, thank you, Bosco. Whenever I'm just gonna peruse around and have a look around. Do, do, do. Okay, I'm just having a look around just to see. There's a bar. Can I interact with that? No? Okay. I know he gets into trouble all the time, and everyone just sort of accepts uh, he'll be fine, but still. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. I guess a lot overwhelming, now that I think about it. I'm Noelle. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact. Planning on sticking around then? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. 
And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Right. So you've seen the library, obviously. Uh, 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 Walter is quite proud of the collection, but Matteo has made more than a few contributions. Okay, well, have I have got a... Hang on. Uh, I don't want that. I don't want that. Thank you. Gardens are out the doors there. If you need a moment of quiet contemplation, emphasis on the quiet part, at least usually. Let's head upstairs. Okay. Sebastian Banks, Constellation's founder, had this place built decades ago. It was a big to-do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten we're here. Just lead the way. I like this carpet. It's really interesting. I can't get one. So this is the bar. Usually no tender, so help yourself within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. You're in luck. We were almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. It's been nice having the place so full. That's a nice painting. That's interesting as well. That's interesting. Okay, this will be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet, and Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so I'd better get back to it. Don't want to keep her waiting too long. Enjoy! Okay, thank you. I'm going to have a sleep for 24 hours. So, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes episode two of Starfield. So, thank you, everyone, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye for now.